I first got involved with Are You OK? It was early days for them, but it was simply through a conversation with a friend who was, was working there and said they were looking for some ambassadors. The appeal for me was, it's a, a really simple message. I, I love what they're about. Um, you know, it's not necessarily about raising money. It's just creating awareness and getting people to have conversations. The importance of, are they really OK? I think it's really key this year. Sometimes when you do ask that question, you might not be satisfied with the first answer. So maybe it's not the first time. I might be asking them again or um, trying asking in a different setting or a different way. But the importance is actually asking that question and being there for them and then listening to, to see what's going on. I think mental health um, within society has made some huge changes, even just in the, the 10 years where I've been specifically working with Are You OK? Their messaging is, you know, how can we make this every day of the year? And I think society is um, really jumping on board it still requires investment, it still requires education, and that's why I'm so proud to be an ambassador. Any company, any sporting team, any organisation that's willing to talk about it, I want to be a part of that and help share the message. There's so many wonderful services out there, and Are You OK? is around trying to prevent things escalating, of course, but if it does get to more of a crisis stage or you, know, you do feel like you need to speak to someone, there's some wonderful services, um, Lifeline, Beyond Blue, there's plenty of resources online, but even just within your own networks, you're gonna have those um, resources there too. You know, the friend that's always willing to have a coffee with you or someone you can grab to go for a walk, whatever that might be, it's about um, knowing the services are there, but being brave enough to reach out as well. MRL has had some fantastic initiatives around uh, mental health and wellness and having a real focus on that as a company is really key to the overall well-being of the organisation. You know, having Chris Harris on board is, is a real asset, um, lots of different initiatives around Lifeline, Are You OK specifically, and it's just great to see that as a company they're prioritising this space to make sure that they're really looking after their employees.